Hi, I'm Rich Brown, Senior Editor for CNET.com. Today we're going to take a look at the Dell Inspiron 530S. So this is a fixed configuration model of this system. It'll only show up on uh, store shelves. And we're not really that thrilled about it. As you can see, it is a slim tower PC, but it's a little bit bigger than some of your average systems in that category. And so it makes it a little bit clunky. You could fit this in the living room, but you might not want to just because it's so kind of tall and takes up maybe a little more space than it needs to. On the front panel, you can see it's actually pretty spare. There's a DVD drive hidden behind that door. And here, there's actually space for a media card reader, but there isn't one in this model. So that's kind of a drawback here. So come around to the back of the system, and you can see, again, there's really not a whole lot going on. The only video output is standard VGA, so there's no DVI, no HDMI, so it really kind of limits your uh, options for the type of displays you can connect the system to. And uh, the only peripheral input is USB. There's no digital audio, there's no Firewire, no uh, eSATA. It's really, uh, you know, a pretty spare configuration. Now inside the case, it's really not that remarkable. You have this cross piece here that kind of gets in the way. We can take that right off though. Removing that, you can see there's a basic expansion. You have PCI Express, which is great for half-height graphics. It can improve the performance a little bit if you want. You've got four memory sticks. That's great. You know, you have the slots to upgrade if you want to, but that also means you have to uh, throw the current ones away. There's four gigs in the system. That should be enough to uh, handle most common tasks. The hard drive bay is a little bit irritating though, because as you can see, there's room for another one, but it's way behind this one in front. So you've got to take this one out and put the new one in. It's kind of cumbersome. Overall, we're not in love with this system. Its budget price means you don't have to spend a lot for it, but at the same time, you can get better features for a similar price from other vendors. So I'm Rich Brown. This is the Dell Inspiron 530S.